All right, family, today we're gonna head to Petco because I am in my uh, hometown of Bloomington Normal, Illinois, and this is the only Petco that I've ever been to that actually has a frag tank. Like I've seen Petco's where they've got coral inside the tanks, you know, just kind of like haphazardly, just kind of scattered around all the tanks, but I kind of want to see what they have in this frag tank today. I like to check it whenever I come home, and uh, sometimes, uh, honestly never, there has been gems for low prices, but we'll see what they've got today. All right, walking inside, this Petco was the place I went all the time for crickets when I was a kid. And here's the frag tank. Now, right off the bat, you're seeing some issues, right? Green hair algae, overpriced frags that are in poor health, an $89 green hammer that's not green. I mean, nothing a little TLC couldn't fix, right? That's not terrible pricing on assorted Zoas, minus the nuisance algae, of course. There's just so much potential for a tank like this at a big box store. I hope I caught it on a bad day. It hasn't always looked like this. We'll have to check back in here when we come back. Well, I wish I could say I was surprised, but I'm not surprised whatsoever by that display. Oh my gosh, it's so bad. Not only are you selling Kenya trees for 40 bucks, but everything is covered in green hair algae. It's just unsightly. The coral doesn't look healthy. It's trying to survive in whatever conditions you've put it in. And like, don't get me wrong, all four coral in Petco, if you're gonna do it the right way, if you've got somebody, maybe you've got a hobbyist that's uh, taking control over the coral stuff and they know what they're doing. Obviously, whoever was doing it before is not doing it now. And that is not a good look for any kind of any anybody who's wanting to get into the hobby. Like, I'm not buying a coral tank because I just saw that and was wowed. And it, it makes me sad because those are living animals. Like, we take care of living animals. We try to make sure that they have the best environment that they possibly can on a daily basis. Water changes, making sure that the, uh, the system is dosed well. But that just, it's not a good look, Petco. It's not a good look. If you're going to have a frag tank, have a frag tank. Don't have whatever that was. That was unbelievable.